Hey y'all, um, I just wanted to say hey today. I'm about to go out. I have to get washing, I don't know, this weekend for some reason. We have so many like towels and a lot of stuff. So I have to go get some washing powder, it's boring. And um, what do you call it, softener. And I have to get some groceries. But um, I just wanted to show you my gardenias because I'm so happy. They literally, I mean, the smell of that just makes me so happy. But I put them in this little milk jug. I showed you, so it's, it's not really milk. Actually, a candle came in this, and I cleaned it out and saved it. But um, I think it's so cute. And they smell. Uh, they say there's a connection between the smell and the brain and, like, happiness. And um, I believe that because they smell so good. I don't know. I just keep smelling them. It makes me feel better. Um, and then I got these out of my yard today. And I don't know what these are called, but literally the smell of this rose. I don't know. I don't know how to find the name of it, but it smells like perfume. It's amazing. So I, oh my God, these two things are just magnificent. And look how gorgeous they are. This is the same rose bush, but sometimes it comes out more white and other times it comes out more pink, but the smell is the same. It's like just heaven. I, I, so between the gardenia and this very, I don't know what this rose is, I'm gonna find out, but it makes me happy. Um, yeah, I don't know, I don't really, I don't know, don't really feel whatever today, but it's okay. I, I was looking through some positive quotes you know, things to kind of make you uplift. And um, I found one that I kind of like, and um, it says, um, oh, I just got a message on my phone from Clayton. <laughs> That's so funny. It doesn't stop the video. Most of my, when I get a message, it stops, but he just texted me something. It's funny. Um, sorry. ADD. <laughs> um, it's what it said, this quote, which I'm taking it in, and it feels like it fits me. Um, it says, you can't stop the waves, but you can learn to surf. Yeah. I don't think I'm going to actually learn to surf. I want to paddleboard. But um, just the analogy fits me. I mean, I'm here in California at the beach. There's a lot of waves all the time, and I love it. But, um, you know, it does feel a little like the waves keep coming and kind of getting a little over it. But um, you know what? Just learn to surf. So I'm trying, trying to learn to surf. I feel like some days I maneuver it good, and um, some days I just don't maneuver it at all. But it's a lot of new things for me and a lot of hard things. But, um, you know, I talk all the time about how the ocean goes in and out and the tide comes in and out and we're just putting out the good and it will come back. Um, there's things for me that are so important in my life and you know it's important to be loyal. It's, a, it's important to me to be 100% real you know and um, man like nobody better say anything about my kids because I will just take the head off, keep walking. Like don't talk about my kids you know they may not be perfect but i will try to direct them and help them you don't <laughs> you know so i don't i don't take that at all um but i'm learning to be a little bit more trying to be a little bit more like that you know for myself anyway just kind of being real with you how i'm feeling you can probably tell i'm not like super chipper but whatever you know it'll come back um that's the way i am you know, I, I literally was born that way. And um, another long story he wants to know, but one day I will write my whole story. And it's quite shocking. It's not what people think. But, um, you know, I do think that I was born this happy child. I think, you know, that God was like, I'm going to make you happy. And then that, it was kind of like a test of how much can you endure and still be happy. And um, you know what? A lot. And there was something in me, you know, about, like, I'm going to make you not happy. I'm going to wipe that smile off your face. 
it just made me be more happy. It made me feel like, you know, I don't want to be like that. I don't want to be negative and unhappy. I want to be happy. And I love to dance. When I get, when I dance and when I sing, when I hear good music, um, all of this stuff goes away and I just feel happy. So I'm about to get in my car, I'm gonna crank up the music, and it was super fun to dance with Jonas and my daughters. I wish Caroline had been there and Clayton, but they had stuff they were doing, but um, that was a good moment, you know. And um, I'm gonna show you later a couple of new products that I bought um, for your, like, uh, one's hairspray and one's mascara. But I'm just gonna end this with um, keep going, keep moving, I'm sending it to you and I feel you sending it back to me. And good things are now, but I do believe the best is yet to come. Much love, you guys.